Hi Miss Room here. Um, today I wanted to talk to you about biomes around the world. In the exam you could be asked to describe uh, what each biome is like. You could be also asked to describe where it is in the world or its distribution. Um, so I'm going to talk to you about eight different biomes, the first of which is tropical rainforests. Tropical rainforests are found near the equator. They are found between the tropics, Tropic of uh, Capricorn and the Tropic of Cancer. Um, if you need to give some examples, a perfect one is the Amazon rainforest, which is found in South America, the majority of which is found in Brazil. Uh, rainforests are also found in Central Africa and in Asia, particularly Southeast Asia. Uh, rainforests are hot, uh, usually above 27 degrees centigrade uh, all the way through the year. They're also very wet. Precipitation tends to be above 2,000 millimetres per year. Uh, a huge variety of plant and animal species live there. Okay, the second biome I'm going to talk about is the savanna. It's also known as tropical grasslands. It's generally found in Central Africa, North Australia and Central South America. It is very hot, like the tropical rainforest, but it is dry with uh, two seasons during the year, a dry season and a rainy season. During the dry season, everything dies out. During the rainy season, everything grows very quickly. Uh, it's very grassy. Uh, with the occasional tree. Uh, the third biome is deserts. Deserts are actually found on every continent in the world, uh, which some people find surprising. Uh, Antarctica is actually uh, the largest cold desert on Earth, um, and it's called a desert because it has very little precipitation. However, uh, in the exam, if you're asked about deserts, it's usually going to be asking you about hot, arid areas, the largest of which is the Sahara Desert in Africa. Uh, deserts um, tend to be very hot during the day, but cold at night, with very, very little precipitation. They are the hottest and driest places on Earth. Uh, and they, as I said, they can be found in many, many places around the globe. They do tend to be found mainly around the tropics lines, however. Uh, they can be sandy, or they can be rock, or they can actually have some scrub growing on them as well. Okay, I'm now going to talk about temperate grasslands. Temperate grasslands tend to be found in continental places, so away from the... Uh, the seas and the oceans, inland, um, places which have mild weather uh, and moderate rainfall. So for example the prairies of the United States or the veldt in South Africa. Uh, deciduous forests are the next biome I'm going to talk about. These are mainly found in the USA and in Europe. The weather needs to be mild and wet uh, for this kind of forest to grow. Deciduous forests are trees that lose their leaves in winter and then regrow in the spring. Um, the climate is usually referred to as temperate maritime, maritime being near oceans and seas. Okay, the sixth uh, biome I'm going to talk about is the coniferous forest. Coniferous forests are found mainly in Scandinavia, Canada, Russia. They're that classic Christmas tree uh, type shape of tree and they're evergreen trees so they keep their leaves or their needles more likely throughout the whole year. Uh, you need a cool climate for this uh, with moderate rainfall. The tundra uh, is the next biome. It uh, surrounds the poles. It's a very cold climate um, and there's very limited flora plants or, and fauna living there, fauna being animals. Um, quite uh, deserted, often a lot of wilderness is found there. Lastly we have the poles, um, so polar biome uh, found at the very north and very south of uh, the earth, uh, Antarctica and the Arctic. It's very very cold it's likely to be relatively dry as well, uh, with few fauna and flora living here. Okay, hope this helps you understand biomes a lot better. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.